Hey guys, Tyler here. Welcome back to my channel. Today we will be looking at four products for the Rivian. These products were sent to me by EV Base in exchange for this video review. If you like the products, you can find them on their website or on Amazon. If you go to their website, you can get 15% off using the code Tyler, and that's on top of any sale prices they may already have. So let's get started. All right, first up, this product is specific to the R1S, and that's because it is a cargo cover, it retracts, it goes in, it fits really well into the two different spots that are already inside the Rivian. Now, Rivian sells a very similar product for $250 on their website. Uh, this is currently listed on EV Base's website at $139. Um, and so far, I'm really happy with it. It does what I want it to, it covers things that I don't want in view. Um, you know, if you're parking nowadays, it's, it's pretty dangerous. People will bust your window and steal whatever they can see. So keeping those items covered is a good idea. Now I haven't seen the one from Rivian, but I imagine it's uh, as good or better quality than this one. Rivian makes good stuff. But as far as I can see with this, it uh, does everything I need it to. And I think it's well worth the price at 140. Next, I have a sunshade, and this is gonna replace an accordion style sunshade that I was using from a previous car. And typically, I don't like these kind that um, you have to ball up, but this item does fit perfectly, and surprisingly enough, it collapses pretty easily. You just kinda smash it, and it, it fits back in the case. And this packs up quite a bit smaller than the accordion one I was using. That accordion one was from a GMC Envoy and it fit pretty good uh, in the windshield of this car. But this one fits exactly right and it gives you privacy when you want privacy. But more importantly, it uh, keeps the heat and the sun out during the summertime. And so far I'm very happy with this item. All right, next up I have these yellow silicone covers. These go on the tow hooks on the front of the car. And I don't add a lot of stuff to my car, but I think they do look nice along with the other yellow accents that this car uses. Um, it's just enough to kind of uh, differentiate my vehicle. Uh, where I live, there's only a few other R1T trucks that I've seen. But then about two weeks ago, a friend of mine said, hey Tyler, I saw another white R1S in town. And I was like, no. But sure enough, I saw it with my own eyes uh, just two or three days ago. It's a white R1S with the 20 inch wheels, so it's a little different, but uh, this is a good way just to distinguish your car and if you like to uh, personalize it a little bit. I don't think it's too flashy. Um, okay, and finally, what I have in here is a sunshade for the roof glass. And I haven't installed this yet, but let's go ahead and do that and see how that goes. And as you can see, I think that something like this is good for um, people who want to keep the car cooler in the summer. I really love that glass roof, so I don't necessarily want to keep it covered very often, but um, in car camping, if I'm trying to insulate the car a little better, um, I think it's a good idea. I slept in a parking structure uh, a few weeks ago in Las Vegas, and this would have been good to help darken the vehicle. I think um, if you're having any issues with your head getting warm because you're really tall and your head's close to the glass, uh, this is a good way to solve that issue. And if you're leaving pets or animals in the car for uh, you know a little while with the AC running, this is just a good way to help keep the car cooler. Uh, as we can see here, it does fit really well and uh, they've made it where you can take it in and take it out quite easily uh, and store it when you don't want to use it. Okay, so as far as installing the roof sunshade goes, uh, the first time doing it took me about 10 minutes. I think I could do it a little quicker in the future, but you use these little clips along the edges and those go around where the glass meets the headliner to hold it in place. As far as the other items that I've bought from EV Base, let's take a look at those. These are still doing great. I have the 
uh, center console organizer. It is holding up well. I like that it keeps separation. Um, it's not so deep to reach in for items now and I can kind of stash some things beneath the tray that I, that I don't need very often or that I want to uh, hide. And then um, this front center console organizer has been good. Um, I'd like to maybe see some different uh, arrangements available, but the main thing is it keeps uh, items from rolling around in this big open space where they would be rolling without it. And then as far as these uh, side handle organizers go, it's just a place to put small items where they don't fall through the handle. In my last car, those handles actually had a spot where you could put items and if you try to put things in the handles here, they'll, they'll fall right through without these uh, handle organizers. I hope that this review has been helpful to you and shown you some of the products available through EV Base. Remember to use that discount code TYLER for an extra 15% off any sale they're already having. And um, if you want more Rivian content, please be sure to subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much.